All right, let's get into it. Murray Erasmus, the seasoned umpire from South Africa, is hanging up his hat after the second New Zealand-Australia test match in Christchurch. He's been around for quite a while, calling the shots in some big games. He's been on the field for 82 men's tests, 124 men's ODIs, 43 men's T20Is, and 18 women's T20Is. Plus, he's been the TV umpire for 131 international games. From now on, Cricket South Africa will decide which matches he'll be working. Erasmus has quite the resume. He's been part of four men's Cricket World Cups, seven men's T20 World Cups, and three women's T20 World Cups. He's also officiated in two men's Champions Trophy tournaments. Remember that nail-biting 2019 World Cup final between England and New Zealand? Yeah, he was one of the two on-field umpires for that. Last year, Erasmus made a call that made history, resulting in Angelo Matthews being the first batter to be timed out in international cricket. Reflecting on his career, Erasmus said, I've had a blast officiating in top-notch matches worldwide. He's been on the ICC elite panel of umpires since 2010, making him one of the longest-serving umpires alongside Rod Tucker. Erasmus added, It's been a heck of a ride, but I think it's time to step back and find another way to contribute to the game. Rod Tucker, speaking on behalf of the elite panel, praised Erasmus, saying he's the kind of guy who makes everyone feel comfortable. Tucker even compared him to the legendary David Shepard, known for his calm demeanor and immense respect in the cricket world. Erasmus has been recognized for his excellence, winning the ICC Umpire of the Year Award three times, in 2016, 2017, and 2021. He started his journey as an international umpire back in February 2006. So, as Erasmus closes this chapter of his career, Cricket bids farewell to one of its most respected figures on the field. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy our content, consider subscribing to help us grow and continue creating quality videos for you.